batteries are now working. When you push the button, you get a five minute timer. The timer is just a light, so it does not count down, but let's go ahead and get work on our project. I did find the instructions. So it looks like we are making a uh, choco berry milk and berry cereal donuts. All right. So uh, let me change the camera angle and let's get started. So let's start with some, let's start with, let's start with the easy one. So we're going to start with some adorable Chago Berry Milk. It says 100% total yum. Berry goodness and Chaco good. 100% good stuff. The little sun and a little... It's cocoa berry. My bad. Not chocolate berry. Cocoa berry. So chocolate... Coconut milk. All right. Or cocoa... Coconut. All right. And then we're going to need our little ices. Adorable little ice cubes and their little bag with their little clip. We're gonna go ahead and turn this guy upside down for now. And we're gonna need our little cup and straw and some strawberry slices. Happy Sun Farms. Cute little strawberries. All right. All right, I am switching this to um, a bear desk so that way I, um, if I do spill any risen, it is on a surface that is easy to clean up. Um, and if you do any spill uh, resin and you need to clean it up, your best bet is to spill it up with, uh, clean it up with alcohol. So I have already made myself some mini paper towels because my mess will be tiny. So. Put those in case but I have a little spray bottle of alcohol over here just in case but here we go so let's look at the directions and see how far how much of this we're gonna ignore so it says to fill it up three almost almost all the way to the top with resin and then put ice cubes and strawberries and put in the straw and stir hmm. I feel like I feel like that would be difficult so I think I'm going to fill it up, put in this about halfway and start putting stuff in and then fill it up a little more and put more stuff in. There's some tape on the top. Oh, okay. No. No safety seal, so that's nice. All right, and put a couple. I put the lid back on. As you can see, I did not get very much. I'm gonna grab my little bag of ice. Take off the adorable little plastic tie. Is that not the most adorable thing you've ever seen? All right, let's see. cute this one fell out so adorable okay so I'm opening my straw I really want to just push those ice cubes to the side A 
and my tiny little thing of strawberries. If they'll let me. Sindel says hi. I'll put some on the sides. Like a so. Sorry. Sticking to the straw. Couple more strawberries. Again, push them to the side. Every side has a little strawberry slice. Great. Right. Hopefully we can get a little more resin to fill this cup to the top. And we'll just do a little decorations on the top. I'll put a little more a few ice cubes in the top. Now we're going to put actually our straw where we want it. I want a couple strawberries on the tippy top. if it was standing up but I don't know that it's gonna let me do that all right what do we think cute all right well let's use our little oven luckily it has an adjustable tray so we can put our frozen our frozen drink in. And now we wait five minutes. While we're waiting for that to bake, let's go ahead and open our surprises because I don't have anything to decorate my donut with. Well, okay. The tweezers would have been helpful earlier. So, I don't know how much that of a surprise that is. Just would have been helpful earlier. Alright. So, we got Choco Berry Rings. I think the surprise is the bowl, maybe. Maybe the bowl is the surprise. And we got the nozzle, which is great because I spent like 20 minutes looking for the nozzle because I could not find it. So, alright. I'm putting all my leftover stuff in the refrigerator and we're still waiting for the timer to go off. So I'm going to go ahead and set everything up and we'll be back with you. All right, so now here's our ingredients. We have some chocolate donuts. We, it looks like we have some vanilla glaze and some cereal bits. Now I... What to do. I know I'm going to make a mess with this glaze. I don't want to make a mess on my ha happy little my little liner. Right? I don't want to ruin the liner. And I want to be able to move my donuts independently. Off and on, on, on and off the tray. Also, I have some extra strawberries left like roughly a donut's worth, right? So should I do a strawberry and a cereal donut? That seems more fun. 
All right, so let's try it. So let's get our glaze ready. Oh, this one does not have, it does have like a little safety seal. I'm gonna put my, my little nozzle on here. So I've seen, I've seen other people do this and almost always the middle of the donut gets all the glaze. I don't want the middle of the donut. I want a donut, not a cupcake. So I'm gonna try like kind of coating it. On the outer edge, while spinning, well, I was trying to spin my tray, but I don't know what with it. All right. Sorry, much concentration. What do we think? All right. No. No. Oh, I forgot to read the ingredients. It is really hard to read on my tiny camera. 100% um, sunshine, vitamin fun, and total smiles. Okay, I think my, I think my donut looks good. How do I open this without flinging them everywhere? I think we use scissors because that is the only way I can do this, I think. I want a couple of each color because uh, of course, the, the the blue ones are hardest to get. Okay. This seems like a a dexterity game here. I don't want them too even, because that would be silly. I want them to look like a donut. Right? Not you, not you. Over there. So many purple. Pink. That one's that one went clinging. Whoop. Now the best thing about this donut, I forgot to tell you, but but both of these donuts are very different. Like they are, hopefully when I take this one out of the oven, I can show you, but they were very, um, they were very, uh, distinctly different donuts. That made me happy. They weren't just like two donuts made out of the same mold. They were very distinct, distinctly different. Okay, I need one more, I think. We're gonna double up a blue one right here. How do we think that looks? Okay. I 
wanting to move this onto the baking tray. And we will bake it. Oh, hey, our other drink should be done. Oh, it's toasty. It's the warmest, warmest ice drink I've ever had. What do we think? Looks pretty cute. Because it took so long, my little, my little, ups, um, my little strawberries did not stay up. But they're still, pre it's still pretty cute. Put it up here for now. Put our single donut in. You know, I'm going to move the tray up. I don't know why. I don't think it matters. But, no. So my tray is upside down. Interesting. Okay, I'm going to put the, put our little guy in there. You can see it. Little donuts. Bakey bakey. And we will work on the next one. All right. Another paper towel. Get our next little donut victim. I feel like this worked out pretty well with keeping a hole in the middle and being able to turn it. Oh, I'm, I just got resin on my hands because I. So when you do that, make sure you just put a little alcohol on your hands. Be careful you don't have any open wounds. And you can get it right off. Okay. Here we go. Did I use all that? There we go. Looking spiffy. Okay, I'm gonna put my tweezers on my paper towel and I'm actually I'm gonna get my tweezers. Put a strawberry there. Strawberry. Better if they were like all going in the right direction. That's what we need to do. I like it. Wish I had some sprinkles. And I could put, would a couple cereals make it too much? I think so, I think so. Less is more, less is more. All right. Let's check how our donut is doing. glaze do we have? Hmm? Should we just see if we can make some cereal? So I'm gonna put 
some of them in the side a little bit. So you can see them from the side. All right. So now we have a donut and some cereal to bake. Jack's all done. Cocoa berry milk, berry cereal, berry donuts, and uh, strawberry donuts. I think they look adorable. Uh, I like that they, my donuts are completely independent of the thing so I can remove them especially as I use them as doll props I like them to be able to use uh, be used um, I'd like to put them on doll hands and last but not least here's our final kitchen with projects our cute little cupboards a little utensil trays our drawers our refrigerator and our oven with removable tray. I hope you enjoyed this this box opening. I know this <laughs> this is a, a fledging link channel so please like and subscribe and let me know if there's anything I can do to make these videos a little more enjoyable. Thanks so much for watching.